say the same thing twice I'm awkward when I speak Ain't got the perfect smile Don't turn heads on my street Trying to be a superstar like everybody else But being myself is something I do well Whatever you do What's your funniest memory? Um, when people drew all over my head when I lost my hair. <laughs> when we were doing mentoring and uh, all the year sevens were lining up and I was in year ten, and I got asked by Mrs. Stoneham if uh, which line I needed to be in. I told her if I was a mentor, and she uh, was a bit embarrassed. And I was quite embarrassed too, to be honest. Someone weed in my shoes once over there, and then left them there for two weeks. <laughs> in drama when Ed Clifford got stuck in a chair. My funniest memory is Miss Payne tripping up Mr. Taylor during the sleeping bag race in Rag Week. <laughs> when Ellie bent James on the field and he ripped his trousers and then had to go up in achievement assembly and explain to Miss Everyone in front of the whole year why he had his blazer wrapped round his ripped trousers. Remember that fire alarm that went off in a lightning storm? That was me. <laughs> I accidentally hit it and I threw the school into chaos for about 20 minutes. Oh, when we made Mr. Harvey and Dr. Halsey kiss in form for our Christmas card. The sleeping bag race. When Avs threw a plastic knife at Miss Bennington's head. The summer of year eight, there was me and a group of girls who were called the Jordettes and leapfrogging, leapfrogging each other. It was, it was a beautiful experience and I will always remember that summer. When we went to London Dungeons as a trip, I was at the back of the, uh, the group with Alex Payne and Miss Everell. <laughs> And um, there was a sign up which said House of Pain, and Miss Everett turned to us and said, Oh, sounds like a hardcore porn film, doesn't it? My funniest memory is when Izzy convinced Abs she was going to grow hair all over her face like Chewbacca, and Abs felt so bad that she cried. Um, on the Year 7 Spanish trip, when Rob Peel left the shower curtain outside of the bath and flooded the bathroom. Probably when 
Reese Edwards chat in a sandwich in the playground. Uh, Reese Edwards chat around there in a bread sandwich. Um, we didn't have a supply teacher, so the boys decided it would be a good idea to get their deodorant can out of their bag, spray a penis on the floor, and then set it on fire. What's your funniest memory of the year group? Um, probably um, Sasha worrying that she wouldn't get an offer from York because she got drunk at the Christmas ball. Oh, I think that would definitely have to be um, when Charlie Vaughan stuck Sam Fenwick's ears to the side of his head and his fingers together like this with super glue. When I had uh, 10AG who came to 11AG, they just made me laugh every single lesson and that's so important and I still miss that. What will you miss most about your time at the Howard? The drama. And bakery. Seeing everyone and friends I've made. Probably pissing off Ed. My friend! I would miss the student teacher relationships that you uh, you get to have with uh, you know your favourite teachers like Mr. Ashby and Mr. Taylor Peace. I will miss the fun we had while learning in the community that we built within these grand halls. What will you miss most about year 13? The absolute exuberance and just the way you respond to everything and your optimism. You're just you're just delightful. Describe the Howard in one word. Lanyard. Idiosyncratic. Exhausting. Overrated. Overrated. Uh, what have you gained from your time at the Howard? Wait. <laughs> A great ability at avoiding homework. <laughs> I found 20p in the canteen once. If you were a biscuit, which biscuit would you be and why? A party ring, because I never get left on the table. Irish tea, because all people love me. <laughs> I'd be a uh, curry powder biscuit, because they're spicy. <laughs> Soggy, because... A nice biscuit, because I'm nice. The, the one that's shaped like an owl, because... You know the one that's like a sandwich in the top of the middle? Because it looks weird, and I'm a bit weird, and it's an owl, and there isn't a biscuit shaped like a cat. Otherwise, I'd be that one. I would be a jammy dodger because I'm sweet on the inside and I'm also very nice to look at. Digestive because I'll absorb all the facts you throw at me. A bourbon because it matches my complexion. Oh, no, no, no. I feel it. <laughs> I'd be a VM VM because I'm good. Penguins. I'm a penguin because my joke's rubbish. A Nature Valley bar. What is there not to like? Um, a bourbon um, because it sounds historical and it's got a cool name. Bourbon. Which teacher will you miss most? Uh, probably Jordan Edwards. Jordan Edwards and uh, Joanne Spires, because they're legends. Miss Harvard. Any final words of wisdom? Um, be the change that you want to see in the world. Don't spend too long trying to think of a funny answer to a question. Better to be a lion for one day than a sheep for all your life. Never drink tequila on an empty stomach. Have a glass of vodka first. <laughs> yeah. It's been a long day without you, my friend And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again We've come a long way from where we began Oh, I'll tell you all about it when I see you again When I see you All the planes we flew, good things we've been through Then I'll be standing right here talking to you About another path I know we love to hit the road and laugh But something told me that it wouldn't last Had to switch up, look at things different, see the bigger picture Those were the days, hard work forever pays Now I see you in a better place See you in a better place Ah uh. How can we not talk about family when family's all that we got? Everything I would do, you were standing there by my side And now you gon' be with me for the last it's ride It's been a long day without you, my friend And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again, I see you again. We've come a long way, yeah, a long way. from where we began you know we started. Oh, I'll tell you all about it Go watch your way.
laying the vibe is feeling stronger with small turn to a friendship a friendship turn to a bond and that bond will never be broken the love will never get lost and when brotherhood come first then the line will never be crossed established it on our own when that line had to be drawn and that line is what we reach so remember me when i'm gone can we not talk about family when family's all that we got? Everything I went through, you were standing there by my side. And now you gon' be with me for the last ride. So let the light guide your way. Yeah. Hold every memory as you go. And every road you take. Without you, my friend And I'll tell you all about it When I see you again We've come a long way From where we began Oh, I'll tell you all about it When I see you again When I see you Standing in line, the clubs I'll never get in It's like the bottom of the ninth And I'm never gonna win this Life hasn't turned out quite the way I want it to be Tell me what you want I want a brand new house on an episode of Cribs And a bathroom I can play baseball in And a king size tub big enough for ten plus me yeah, that's what you need I need a, a credit card that's got no limit And a big with a bedroom in it Gonna join the Mile High Club at 37,000 feet Been done I want a new tour bus full of old guitars Find a star on Hollywood Boulevard Somewhere between Cher and James Dean is fine for me So how you gonna do it? I'm gonna trade this life for fortune and fame I'll even cut my hair and change my name Cause we all just wanna be Living in 
top houses driving 15 cars The girls come easy and the drugs come cheap We'll all stay skinny cause we just won't eat And we'll hang out in the coolest bars In the VIP with the movie stars Every good gold digger's gonna wind up 